Hey guys, my name is Chaotic, and in this video, I'm going to be featuring and talking about the remastered version of GTA San Andreas on the Xbox 360. So starting off, I have a little bit of background information, and if you guys were not aware, GTA San Andreas was officially 10 years old as of yesterday, on the 26th of October 2014. So yes, its 10th anniversary was yesterday, and to celebrate that, Rockstar reconditioned and remastered GTA San Andreas, and they re-released it on the Xbox 360 in 720 HD. As of right now, there is no information relating to the remastered version of GTA San Andreas being re-released on the PS3 or the next-gen consoles as of right now. This is quite a special anniversary, this is not something which you see very often from gaming companies where they re-release their old games with improvements to mark the anniversary of the initial release date. So anyway, moving on to the main purpose of this video, that of course being the jetpack in GTA San Andreas. Now the jetpack was a fan favourite back when GTA San Andreas was initially released. I however will put a link in the description to a page where you can view all of the cheat codes which work on the remastered version of GTA San Andreas. Now to activate the jetpack cheat code on the Xbox 360, what you want to press on your controller first of all is left, then right on the D-pad, then press LT, LB, RT, RB, and then back on the D-pad you want to press up, down, left, right. And after pressing that combination of buttons, the jetpack will then spawn in and it will be on your back. Now luckily with a the jetpack, there is no limitations to the amount of time and use you can get out of it. It has an unlimited amount of fuel, so you can fly around for as long as you want and explore and go wherever you want, and you haven't got to worry about running out of fuel. Without stating the obvious, there are so many different things which you can do with a jetpack, like flying around, getting to places quicker, and exploring all the different rooftops and different locations which you can go to on GTA San Andreas. There have of course been many rumours over the past few months of the possibility of a jetpack being introduced into GTA 5 as a cheat code. As of right now, there is no such feature either in online or in story mode. However, there are rumours that the jetpack cheat code will be added to GTA 5 story mode in the next gen release. As much as I want this rumour to be true, I seriously doubt that Rockstar will be adding the jetpack cheat code into GTA 5. But I'm sure if Rockstar were to add the jetpack cheat code into GTA 5, whether it be on the Xbox 360 and PS3 or on the next gen release, I'm sure the community would support them in doing so. So anyway, just before this video comes to an end, I thought I'd answer a few questions which people may have, possibly when this video ends. First of all, is this game worth buying? Well, I think it costs about $5. In the UK, it's about £3. So it's very cheap, and if you're a big fan of GTA and GTA San Andreas, then definitely get it, as there is a huge graphical difference. So anyway, guys, I have a question for you. Would you be interested in seeing videos on the remastered version of GTA San Andreas? Now, if you are, even if you're not, be sure to leave a comment on this video giving me your opinion so I can find out whether there is a demand for videos of the remastered version of GTA San Andreas. If you guys could also take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button on this video, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. And if you have not subscribed to my channel already, I recommend that you do, because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So anyway guys, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.